I'm Joe. And I'm Alex. And we run Ghoul Inc. Productions. We don't usually do reviews and stuff like that, but our friend uh, Taylor, who runs Taylor Trash Productions out of San Antonio, Texas, uh, recently did a documentary called Gora. And it's a documentary about a man that some of you might know, Gora Chand Seha. He's an actor from India, and we had the pleasure of working with him in our last film. He's in our film, The Abode of Mad Tales. Yes. Hell of a nice guy. Terrific actor. Uh, these guys put together a little documentary where uh, Gora went on a spiritual quest to the Himalayas and Taylor uh, was the filmmaker behind it. They did it together as a collaboration um, and we really liked it and we really uh, wanted to uh, bring some attention to it. Not that he hasn't gotten a lot of attention already, but uh, as, as a, a sort of an homage and the tip of the hat to Gora and to Taylor, we wanted to put a little something together to kind of bring some more attention to this terrific film. So we're going to sit down, we're going to watch it, we're going to give you some thoughts um, as to what we thought about the film. Um, I personally liked it a lot. And I thought it was fantastic. I'm glad to see a different side of Gora than we are normally used to seeing. Uh, Gora is a very enthusiastic actor um, and really puts himself 100% into whatever acting parts he does. And then some. Yeah. Yeah, so sit back and we're just going to kind of go through this thing for just a little bit. We promise this is not going to be super long. So, And if any filmmakers are out there watching this, Gora wants to be in your yeah, movie. Yeah, put Gora in your movie. You won't regret it. He's awesome. All right, thanks to Taylor and thanks to Gora. And uh, check it out. Thanks, guys. I was torn very early in life into the magical world of acting. I very much want to express my acting skills. So this is what you saw that kind of got him too, that got you too, right? I want to share the Yeah, I saw Gora had done an acting reel where he was standing in front of a green curtain and he kept saying, everything has turned to shit. And he said it over and over and over again, but in different, but in different styles, in different accents. You will not be able to find any actor like me. And that's the truth. I have yet to find anybody yeah. quite like Gora. Yeah. And and it, for me, it was that I saw that. And oh yeah. That was. Um, well, the whole, Gora is saying, you know, put me in your movie, and I'm like, yeah, we gotta put him somewhere. Yeah. Please give me a chance. I'm waiting for you to reply your pal. I wish more people had Gora's attitude when it comes to filming um, so I across long distances because we've filmed with people in different countries. Like and I we've done that with people in the UK. the UK. We've done that with him. We're going to yeah. do it with somebody in uh, Bangladesh. So. Yeah. And it's, it's so doable nowadays with the technology we have. And there's a lot of people out there that have can't in their mind and they're like, well, I can't do that. And it's like, bullshit, you can. We did, and Gore did, and Taylor did. <laughs> He's a maniac, and we love him. The one thing I really like about this movie is that we get to see a side of Gora that, you know, we don't see on Facebook. I mean, he's always very intense and promoting his acting skills and what he'd like to do in, in everybody's film, but this is a, the, the normal side. Yeah. Not the actor side of Gora, but the everyday Gora. The human Gora. Yeah. yeah. Now I am going to the Himalaya mountain, uh, the temple of, uh, called uh, the <laughs> Angel of Ghost, Bhutna Temple. Now I am going. This is the great Himalaya mountain. Going to the heaven. I am going to the heaven. You can watch me, enjoy with me, come with me for a dangerous play, dangerous game. I am enjoying, enjoy with me. I really like the way uh, Taylor edited this too, with it, yeah. the, the going back and forth between the black and white and the color. And, 
and everything. And we know a thing or two about editing, and it is the most arduous freaking thing to do sometimes. And so, I can't speak for Alex, but I don't look for editing things, but I notice them. And I can always notice when somebody's done a really good job with the, the editing. In this world, everything is just an illusion. There some any existence. There is only an existence. The name of that that existence is Brahma. Another way is Buddhism. I respect every spiritual way. But my spiritual is Vedanta. And Gore got to be in our film, and yes. now we get to be in his. So yes. So there is a great ending to this. Yeah, you know, that's just... I think it's great that we live in a, a time when people of like mind can find each other and, and contribute to each other's art, you yeah. know, d despite the distances and what have you, you know? And like I said before, I don't... There's a lot of people out there have a lot of can't in their heart, you know, and, and, and a lot of no and a lot of that kind of thing. And, I just, um, I love that, you know, for people like Gora and, and ourselves, it's just, you know, we don't have time to screw around with can't, the can't attitude. Well, I can't do that. Oh, I can't. Well, why not? Because this guy's in India and we're here. Well, we did it. You know, there's, and the where there's a will, there's a way. And the passion that he's got for doing it. Yeah. You know, it's, it's, I, I, like I said, I rarely see that in people. Yeah. Um, yeah. And so if you're watching this and... You are a filmmaker. Please put Gora in your movie. You will not regret it. It's Absolutely. definitely well worth it. He's a great actor. He's a great guy to, to know and to work with. Um, and He's my Indian brother from another mother. Yeah. I love that guy. And support uh, Taylor Trash Productions and Ghoulink Productions. And uh, hope you liked our little review. We don't usually do this sort of thing. but For Gora, we'd do anything. Absolutely. <laughs>